The secret to living is given. Do it when you don't have it, and I promise you, scarcity will leave your life. The biggest misconception that people have is thinking everything is the same. So what we'll do is we'll just keep putting out our values, keep changing lives, and as they start seeing that, like, wow, these guys are for real and they're doing it, they'll say, like, I want to be a part of that. I want to not just be about myself. Yeah, I'm going to make the money, but I want, I'm going to be able to spend more time with my family. But what I really want to do is I want to be in a position to give and, and create a legacy. And when they, when they feel that, I think they'll know who we are. So we're trying to find like a community project that we could all work on where we can either donate money, time, and whatever it is. And it just happened that Leilani comes up with this really great project that was actually near and dear to all of our hearts because I know for Jerry, me, and Brian, like for of our families, we probably would have been homeless. We want people to know that this isn't just about the money, it's about much, much more than that, okay? It's about legacy. building micro houses for the homeless. It's like, it's like two years ago, right? So I'm like sitting here, I'm, I'm having all kinds of difficulties and challenges in my life, right? I didn't know where my life was headed. And I had all these challenges and it was all about like how am I going to be able to get back on my feet, right? And it was about <laughs> It was about being able to do something really big, but just being able to like, like start from somewhere, right? And I'm, I'm very fortunate. I have an absolutely great family that loves me and supported me through this huge transition that I had. So much, so many things, from financial to me believing in myself, right? It was like really about like, can I do this? And so my family was there. And I cannot tell you what that meant to me. So to be able to have that and that support and knowing that somebody says, like, no matter what happens to you, we got your back, that was huge. So to be able to, to, be, able to be here and give that back, because had I not had that, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have had the success I wouldn't have had. I wouldn't have had the support, the love. And um, to be able to give that back, like that, that's huge. So every house we build here, I, I feel like we're giving somebody that, that, that listen, you can do this. Like we believe in you, we love you. Like you can do this, you know? We all, every one of us has hard times in our lives. And um, it's okay, you're gonna make it through. You know, God loves you, we love you. Let's, let's get you back out there and um, you know, just realize this is, this is just a learning lesson and you're, you're gonna, you'll overcome it. And you're gonna be on to much greater things. Andrew, here with RJ. I just got home from work. Yeah. He's got a brand new house built here. I'm very excited. You have no idea. That's awesome. This is amazing. I don't have the words. <laughs> <laughs> Come home from work, right? Yeah, I come from work. Come right. home from work? Yeah. Come right out of a tent to a house. Yeah. What we want to do right there, right? Yeah. Right uh, there. RJ's gonna be out. For those of you who are like, uh, you know, love to get more people like RJ, get him, get him back out swinging. Come, get a hammer, send funds, whatever you gotta do, but make it happen. We're gonna, we're gonna knock out. How many we need here? Like we, 70? 100? Yeah, 50. We got 50. We need 50 more. We, we need 50 more. We got a, a lot done, and we're gonna get a lot more. So, guys, do your part. You're gonna love it. Look at, look at RJ, man. Thank you. That's worth it right there. We flew down just for that. Look at this, baby. Our handwork isn't that great, but at least we got something done.